Welcome back to the Accessible Art History YouTube channel. In this week's episode of Art History Minute, I'm examining a dynamic work by one of the biggest names in art history. The Fall of Phaeton by Peter Paul Rubens is a dynamic testament to the artist's talent. So to learn more, keep on watching. In Greek mythology, Phaeton was the son of the Oceanid Clime and the sun god Helios. He wanted to be like his father and so he traveled far to the east until he reached his palace. Once there, Phaeton begged Helios to let him drive his chariot. The vehicles what pull the sun into the sky each morning, but the horses were wild and unpredictable. Helios tried to warn his son that only he could control him, but Phaeton was so insistent that Helios finally gave in and allowed him to try. But alas, he couldn't control the horses and then the sun. He accidentally created deserts from getting too close and Icelands from getting too far. Eventually, to save the rest of the planet, Zeus struck the young boy down with a lightning bolt, killing him instantly. In this painting by Peter Paul Rubens, we see the climactic moment of Phaeton's tragic story. Painted around 1604 to 5, Rubens uses bright colors contrasting light to serve as Zeus's lightning bolts. Helios's horses and chariot are tumbling out of the sky with some of the gods and goddesses of the seasons trying to stop them from crashing into the earth. If the viewer looks in the background, there's an astrological circle showing them that they are in the heavens. Peter Paul Rubens perfectly captured the drama, hubris, and movement of this dynamic Greek myth. Thank you.